Alright guys, this video is about about uh installing the two inch spacer on a lifted vehicle. I have a seven and a half half inch lift on the truck and anybody who's going this route um is this is a it's a hell of a job. So what I had to do is um I had to unscrew the sway bar in the rear of the vehicle on both sides and I have to you have to unscrew the shocks on both sides and then you're going to have to lift your 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 jack up with something a little higher because the the, uh, the jack is not going to be able to reach the uh, vehicle um, especially when it's lifted so um, uh so you're gonna have to use two jacks one on uh two one on one side one on the other and um this will allow the axle in the rear to to drop down so you can uh take out the shocks and then um i tried it multiple times so i had to jack up the vehicle on both sides and i also had to use a a tool to kind of ply the uh, axle wider so I can um, install getting it the shock out wasn't too bad but installing it with the two inch spacer was a little uh, difficult but I had to make sure the uh, axle was wide enough to um, get the, the, the shocks in there with the, the two inch spacer. So I use a, another jack to open it up, to widen it up. And, uh, I managed to get it done. I don't recommend you, you, you use jacks with bricks. Um, if you have to take it to the shop, but if you go this route, this is one way you can do it. So if you like the video, Leave your thoughts, comments below. Peace.